Well, here we are tonight, uh, moder moder <laughs> let's start again. <clears throat> well, here we are tonight, uh, back in the shack, and I got a little radio teletype going on right now. Let's turn the volume up so you can hear it. Okay, uh, as you can hear, got a pretty good signal. I wonder what they're saying. So let's open up uh, Airlink Express. We'll open up Airlink Express and let you see what's uh, coming in. And there it is. So let's uh, pause right here for a minute and kind of read the message that's coming across the radio teletype right now. I'll turn the volume back on. Turn it down a little bit, and uh, getting a pretty good decode on it, as you can see in the window, uh, the AirLink Express window. We're getting a lot of solar data coming in right now on uh, sunspot activity, solar flux, doesn't look real pretty good today. Doesn't look too good. The uh, solar flux is 75 and the A index is 6. Uh, on my flex at least that's what it says and that's not very good uh, for bouncing those radio signals off the ionosphere. Signals are kind of uh, dead tonight. I was uh, just on the uh, Oh, mess net and just listening around and really weak signals in every direction from Texas. I was picking up New York uh, fairly strong, but uh, even that control in New York uh, was having trouble uh, transmitting to uh, his relays located around the U.S. So got off the old Miss net without doing anything and came on down the uh, 40 meter band and saw this strong signal coming in on ready and decided to crank it up and uh, see what was being transmitted. Kind of an interesting mode. Uh, not only can you make uh, long distance contacts with it, and there are some uh, RTTY uh, contests during various times of the year where there's lots of signals on the band, uh, usually located toward the bottom of the band. And, uh, but a lot of times, uh, there's some there's information being transmitted everything from uh, solar conditions to weather conditions and even uh, marine reports that give uh, any criminal activity taking place in any of the ports or on the high seas so really no telling what you might run into by just monitoring the uh, ready, uh, radio teletype signals on the radio. Again, that software I'm using is called AirLink Express. I've done a couple of videos already about it. And uh, you can download it for free. That's one of the reasons I like the ham radio hobby. There's dozens and dozens of uh, free software programs out there in the public domain or with the source code available. And if you're a programmer, you can get the source code and kind of change the software uh, and then hopefully repost it for the rest of us to use.
Again, the reason I like Airlink Express, it's real easy to tune. I uh, just make sure you get that double bar that you see on the waterfall right here, right there. See that uh, double bar right there? Can be anywhere, and uh, just move this little blue T in the middle of the bar, and it'll start decoding. Now, if you're getting uh, what looks like trash on the decode, just a bunch of symbols and numbers that don't make any sense, you can just come right up here and change from ready inverted, which is what I'm using right now. You can select ready normal. Now, let me switch it for a second. You'll see what I'm talking about. It's, it's the wrong decode. And watch what you get. I'm going to change to RTTY normal. As you can see, we're just getting uh, symbols on the screen. It's not really decoding it. So that tells you you got to switch to the other mode which I just did, and there it goes again, decoding. Here's to be an ARRL ready message coming in on propagation. Okay, let's kind of send that to the bottom. Get you back to looking at the signal itself on the flex screen. Quite strong signal coming from the ARRL. I don't know where, if it's coming from W1AW. I don't know if they're actually using that station to transmit. More than likely they are, but a great signal coming in on 40 meters right now. So let's shut that off and I'll switch you back to my smiling face. And as I usually do, I wish you clear skies of 73 and remember to keep looking up to see the greatest show on earth right over your head every single night. Just a little bit of radio teletype on the radio tonight. See y'all later.